afternoon, everyone. So, guys, as you can tell, I am tired. My beard is long. My hair is long. I can't deal with this. It has been a long couple of weeks. So, I will give you guys a quick update as to what's going on. So, as we have mentioned before, Janice and her health with her, you know, the cyst that she is dealing with, not doing good. So, she's in a lot of pain, daily pain. And it's kind of like we're, we're getting to the point where like right at the point of surgery, she's going to be like just constantly dealing with stuff. And that's not exactly fun and easy. Thankfully, surgery is coming up. We're happy that, you know, we, we went to the doctors, we got a plan and we are taking action on this plan. We're trying to do it quickly and efficiently, which is very important because Janice's quality of life is diminishing pretty, pretty rapidly, I would say. The last couple weeks, the issue has been this, where Janice woke up one day and she's just in really bad, like, pelvic pain. She's like, hey, I can't do much. I need to take it easy. I was like, babe, don't worry about it. You lay in bed, take it easy. I got it. And from one day, it turns into several days. Not a big deal. Again, I have it. I, I don't have a problem with, you know, handling everything because when I have my days that I don't feel good, she handles everything. And this is how, you know, a teamwork makes dream work, right? That happened. From there, it transitioned into like a few days of migraine. And now, back to pelvic pain. So, it's just been a lot that we have both been dealing with. Janice has been in bed a lot, unfortunately. And it's weighing on her, you know, both mentally, physically, the things that she's dealing with. She wants to be active, do stuff around the house, be with the baby. So, I'm like just taking the baby with me and go off to my errands, do some work, whatever I have to get done. And... So she loves it, don't get me wrong. So that is what's been going on. That's why we have not been posting because I just don't have the time to edit or do vlogs because I'm already doing so much. And Janice, I've been telling her like, hey, don't push yourself to edit or do the vlog. Like you, if you need that help, if you need that rest, that period of time to just take it easy, do that. And all the comments that she has seen from you guys saying, hey, don't worry, take it easy, we'll be here waiting. That helped her as well because she's like, okay, you know, people are understanding and that's good. So I would like to say thank you to everybody for those, you know, kind, loving comments. We do greatly appreciate it. We do read them. It's, it's a challenge and we are working through it each and every single day. It sucks. It's, it's okay to not be okay. And there are moments where I have to tell Janice, lay down, take it easy. And she doesn't want to because she wants to be a mother. She wants to help me. She wants to do stuff at the house. She wants to make food. We want to go out. We want to do stuff. And unfortunately, our bodies are kind of holding us back. It's perfectly okay to not be able to do stuff. Because there are days where I'm powering through and I'm going strong and getting everything done. And the next day I'm like, help. I'm tired. It, it can definitely be overwhelming. So that is why we have not been doing vlogs. And, you know, we've done the community posts both on YouTube and posts on Patreon. Just updating everybody. This is just like a quick, simple update. Next week, we should be back up and running because today, Janice has been doing really well. Still has pain, but she is able to function. Like, she put the baby down and, you know, we're running around, we're doing stuff and no big deal. So she's still in pain, but she's able to actually, you know, muster up the energy and get stuff done, which is very good and helpful for me because I am limited on energy as well, especially with my intestines sticking out of my body. Right now, we're all concentrating on Janice. And from there, we are going to then transition into recovery mode for her and for her surgery. After that, about a month, month and a half of her recovery enters both the baby's birthday and then as well as my surgery. Just like one after the other, guys. This year has been lots of fun and every single year it's been surgery after surgery after surgery. So... It's, it's a challenge for sure. And people I've seen comments go, oh, you guys just like doing that. No, we don't. No, we do not. I like to be normal. I want to be normal. I just want to be able to work, come home, be with my daughter, my wife, go out, play, have fun, just do everything that, you know, any normal person does. And unfortunately, we do have days like that, but unfortunately, there are lots of days that we are restricted. And don't get me wrong, I, I'm okay. I'm a very chill person at heart, but sometimes being forced to not be able to go out after a while can can weigh on you a little bit but all positive guys we are working at it each and every single day we are pushing we want to make sure that we go in the right direction constantly and consistently 
So guys, that is going to be it for this update. I know it was very, very short. That's Janice because the baby, they were giving her a bath. So guys, thank you so much. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. For now, guys, do, and good night.